Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video. Today we're just, uh, discussing a serious topic of how Microsoft's Xbox and Sony's PlayStation could totally fail if the Xbox One and the PS4 do not work out with both of the systems. Today, that's what we're going to be talking about. Love is my love. <laughs> Uh, these companies always over exaggerate about how good their systems are. But if these things totally fail, a whole industry of gaming business can go under and the PC can rule the whole gaming business. Hopefully we'll find out that this is not going to happen. But the freaking PS4 controller is turning into a freaking touchpad iPad type thing. Xbox is trying to keep it slim. And we all know one of the industries is going to fall before the other. So I think Sony's going to fall. They're turning their controllers to something very unoriginal and they're just changing everything until the PS4 isn't really going to be a controller anymore. It's going to be something totally touchpad iPhone type thing like this. It's going to end up something like that. And I'm not sure how it's going to impact gamers or it's a PS4 controller. I think the Xbox One has really made a better improvement in the controllers, not changing like 50,000 different things. I know we all hope deeply that nothing will happen with this because we do not want to only have a PC in our house to play video games on. We want our nice Xboxes and we want our PS3s. I have a PS3 and an Xbox. I prefer the Xbox way over anything. In 2000, uh, the PS2 was released, and then a year later, the Xbox was released. The PS2 struck millions of gamers. The Xbox original, not so much. I preferred the PS2 way over the Xbox original. It came out way before, and I used it so much. It was the best system I've ever had. I was there on release date, I remember. Uh, it was just a really fun time. And then, um... They decided uh, three years before the PS3 to create the Xbox 360. A lot of people thought that Microsoft rushed out the Xbox 360 and just kind of rushed it out uh, without thinking, which did make problems, which created the red ring of death and many other hardware problems that followed with the Xbox. And three years later, the PS3 came into the memo. This is when Sony and Microsoft started to have competing, making HDMI cables and improvements to their systems and updates all around, which definitely made Sony and Microsoft compete to the fullest. This was really a big, giant, enormous battle between the two that uh, that is still going on to this day. And Xbox is winning the battle at this moment. But I think that they're going to be able to do this forever because it's just, it's Xbox. It's a freaking, it's original, man. The PS3 is just changing crap. Like, I hate the HUD. For PS3. I do not like PS3. Xbox is graphics is better. They got freaking Minecraft. Think about that. PS3 did, denied freaking Minecraft. And they were offering all this money, Moje, to get on freaking to get on freaking PS3, but they denied it. Same with State of Decay and much other things I won't even get it into contact to. Alright guys, I'll see you next week. What do you think? Please leave a comment below. I'll see you guys outro. Now you're going to die. <laughs>